Mark's in Fulham. Mark, what do you think motivates all, all of these people who are waking up every morning at the moment to find enormous targets painted on their back by right-wing newspapers? Hello. Hi. Hello. Can you hear me? Loud and clear. Oh, great. I mean, I think the basis of their, their, their decision to do that is based on having the information in which to do so. I mean, I, I, I'm just an average layman in this, in this overall situation. Yes. And to be honest with you, when it came to vote, I wanted to vote, but I never got round to actually doing it. But okay. to do so, I would have voted to leave. Yes. Um, but, the, you know, I, I'm saying that, like most of the country, all our votes were made on the lack of information. And like yourself, you're saying you've got all these documented documents in front of you which help you to make a valid sort of decision. Only after, mate, I didn't, in case you're beating yourself up, I was like you before the vote. I didn't know any of this stuff. Well, there you go. This is the, my point exactly. Yeah. And, you know, it, it, these politicians who we're mentioning now have got the documentation in front of them, can make a valid sort of point of view. And at the end, you know, can, can anyone, how, what percentage of the, uh, the country can make a valid view? Well, that's, I mean, where the, that's where the experts traditionally come in, isn't it? That's where you, when you want to find out about perhaps impacts on medical services, you go to a consultant neurologist. Really? I mean, do you, aren't you allowed to take a, 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 an average point of view with a sort of educated view? Well, it depends what's I mean, on. Is, it depends whether it, you're talking about rocket science or whether you're talking about importing oranges, doesn't it? So if you find two this importers of... rocket science. Oh. This is not rocket science. I don't think it is rocket science. I okay. think... So but how would you solve the Irish border problem, the British border in Ireland? Mm, I don't think that that's easily solved. I think, no. I think that, 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 that is that, that is an issue that's come with the mix-up. I mean, if... Well, the, it was easily predicted. That was actually base, predictable. The main, the, the main basis of the argument right now, the, or the issue, should we say, it's not an argument, the issue is, should there be an, another referendum mm. or not? And I think that if it was given another referendum... With a valid, with a valid sort of information given to us, yes. and I mean us as a nation, yes, I know um, to make a view, we there would be a different point of view. I mean, we've, 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 uh, you know, where most of my information has come from. These valid conversations that you've had on this station. Well, I'm glad, and then I'm going to very arrogantly suggest that if there was another referendum, you probably wouldn't be minded to vote leave this time. Absolutely. I, I'm really tended to feel, well, a hold on a minute, I'm hearing so many different things which are more factual than I've ever heard from the government. Well, I'm flattered that you feel that way, but all of the stuff I've cited this morning has actually come from the government. They just didn't want you to know about it. They, they didn't want Absolutely. it to, it's, it's had to be leaked. Sorry, I'm sorry if I'm disturbing you there. Absolutely, yeah. you there. I, I mean, look, that's my, that goes to the point exactly. It does, doesn't it? So why can, why can you exactly. see it? Why can you see it? And don't, let's not be rude, and I won't mention him again in the next hour because I'm always uncomfortable with reverse filleting con contributors and callers, but it's so clear to you, why can't Ken see what you can see? Or people like Ken? I mean, I, mean, I think they can. Right. I think oh. that is it, but they, they, is it their job, and how do they get the information to the people? I would have thought, in, initially, I would have thought that we was going to get some kind of document in the, in the letterbox well, they can't, um, I guess they can't, because for the key players who are now in the cabinet, it would involve <laughs> admitting that they were wrong to be kind, or that they lied to be accurate, back in 2016, and in some of their cases, um, going back 30 years. Mark, what a lovely call. Thank you so much.